Yo, what is going on, everybody? This is RBT, and welcome back to another Madden 19 video. As today's video is a little bit different, but a video I'm pretty sure that's gonna show you guys something that like 97% of you don't even know is a thing. Hence why I'm making the video. So today, what I am gonna do is show you how to play with Devin Wade in Madden 19 franchise mode and Bill Cower. Yep, Bill freaking Cower. So that wasn't the original intent of the video, but randomly throughout the video, you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about and you'll see why it's in the title. And no, I'm not talking about, like, because we all know you can, like, create a player or change a player's face to Devin Wade or Colt Cruz and then you can just play with them like that. But no, in today's video, I'm actually going to show you how to start a franchise and pick up where Madden 19 Longshot ends. So, like, we're actually going to be playing with the legitimate Devin Wade and Madden 19 franchise. Find it pretty freaking interesting. I'm, I'm going to show you why nobody knows that this is a thing. And what I am going to do in today's video after I show you guys how to do that, we're going to sim like 10 or so years in the future and see how actual Devin Wade's NFL career ends up. So hopefully guys do enjoy today's video. A little bit different, but an idea that I've had for a while now. If you guys do enjoy, let me know by dropping a like. Let's see if we can smash 2,000 likes on today's video. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new. And turn on the notification bell if you haven't. Once again, guys, I have a new series coming out super, super soon. I was hoping it was going to come out today, but it's taking a lot longer to edit than what I expected. And I'm not going to drop the series until the video is absolutely perfect so hopefully you guys are excited for that but with that said let me show you guys how to play with Devin Wade in Madden 19 franchise mode first of all you have to jump into long shot and I know all you guys absolutely love long shot the greatest thing ever to happen to Madden what a beautiful game mode and as you see I am 99% like done with long shot so you do have to complete long shot and get to the very end and unfortunately I gotta sit through here and watch this whole last freaking scene. Oh yeah, Colt Cruz. I think I've seen this guy somewhere. Feel like I've met him before. Crazy, isn't it? Now with that, long shot homecoming is officially over. Next, what you gotta do is sit through the freaking credits that are like 107 minutes long. So, yep, like this is probably why nobody knows this is a thing because nobody sits there and like pays attention and watches the freaking long shot credits so i'll come back in like 27 minutes when these credits are over but once again you have to finish long shot and you have to sit there and like go through all the credits i'm sure bill shepard's a great guy but i don't really care about the sound editors really don't dude i bet peter peter's probably a great violinist dudes i'm literally not kidding this has been eight minutes Eight minutes to me just sitting here looking at text scroll across the screen. So once again, this is probably a big, big reason why not many people know this is a thing. So finally, finally, finally. So we are at the end of the credits and you get the option right here. It says, do you wish to continue playing Devin's story or Colt's story? Unfortunately, since Colt wasn't actually signed to a team in this part of Longshot, you can't actually play franchise with him. I mean, you can edit somebody's face to his, but if you click Colt's story, it brings you to Madden Ultimate Team and you get like his head coach card or whatever, which is I mean, not really that big of a deal. Or you can confirm selection and continue playing Devin's story, and that brings you into a franchise mode that leaves you off where Longshot left off in the story so if we confirm selection on Devin Wade that will bring us into our very own CFM as Devin Wade now once we do that we can see some things which are pretty freaking interesting so you'll really be able to see where this team left off in long shot although you probably don't know it it left off in week 12 and the Texans were seven and four now, I'm pretty sure I looked at this a while back and there was something really weird. Yeah, that's the weird thing. This was the weird thing. So, apparently, a long shot, you know, we played the Titans two consecutive weeks to start off the year. Interesting. Very interesting. Never seen such a thing where teams played each other back to back. But that's how it was in long shot. And continuing on, they beat the Patriots 31 to nothing. So this is what technically the scores were for the Houston Texans in Madden 19 long shot leading up to week number 12. Now, I do want to go and look and see if there's any stats for Devin Wade up to this point. 
Looks like Deshaun Watson was the starting quarterback for the most part. So Devin Wade's stats up to this point. Only has 321 yards passing, 3 touchdowns, and 0 interceptions. Interesting. So, that's just crazy. Deshaun Watson's still the starting quarterback. Who's leading the NFL? Marcus Mariota's leading the NFL in passing yards. That's interesting. So this is going to be the same, I believe. Every single time you continue the story as Devin Wade. And the most important thing, Todd Gurley already has 1,200 yards. That's just crazy. We have, um, let me make sure, let me make sure this game didn't glitch out because as you guys know, in Madden I can long shot, Tajay Sharp's a leading receiver, crazy. Antonio Brown got traded to the Texans, so let me make sure they didn't mess that up. So Antonio Brown is actually on the Houston Texans, so everything in that sense is perfectly correct. So let's now, what I do want to do is go and see what Devin Wade's actual stats are. So this is what Devin Wade's actual overall rating is going to be because it's coming directly from Longshot. So if we view player car, what we'll show us here, we're an 82 overall and he has superstar development. So Devin Wade should become an absolute menace. With superstar development only being 22 years old at an 82 overall, this guy should be a freaking beast about 10 years in the future. Like, he has 96 throw power, 84 deep accuracy, 85 medium accuracy, 87 short accuracy, 85 throw on the run, 86 play action, 86 throw under pressure. This guy's pretty freaking good. But unfortunately for now, I think he is going to be the backup quarterback. So to make things easier for me, and it won't mess up this at all because I don't want to send 10 years in the future as, you know, Devin Wade because that will mess up his progression and stuff. I am going to retire. Oh, that's going to... No, I'm going to create a new character is what I'm going to do because I don't want to retire Devin from the NFL. Although now it says he's an 89 overall, so that's just interesting. Ooh, so if you create a new character, you will retire your current character and your progress with that character will be lost. Are you sure you want to retire your character? Um, okay, this is interesting. I don't know. Will this actually retire Devin Wade? Uh-oh. I don't want to have to go through the freaking credits all again. Oh, God. Oh, freaking God. Uh, let's just... I guess I'll have to do it again if it retires him. Let's see if... Devin Wade still remains on the team or see if he actually freaking retired. So just for the heck of it, well, I won't let, why won't it let me pick an owner? What the heck? Uh, I guess we can pick a coach. Uh, Bill, oh, that was interesting too. I don't know why, I just completely just, that slipped my mind. Bill Cower is the head coach. So the only way you can use Bill Cower as the head coach is if you continue from long shot. So that's another interesting tidbit because you can't hire Bill Cowher as your coach in regular franchise, but since he was the coach for the Houston Texans in long shot, you can actually use him as the head coach in this franchise. But should I do that? Should I just use Bill Cowher? Should I mean, why not? I mean, what does it freaking matter? It's just an experiment. So injuries are off. Oh, so this is, this is like, this, okay, so this is interesting. So this also shows you, this is, I didn't even notice this. This is what the settings are in long shot that you don't really know is a thing until you do something like this. So it has the skill level for long shot on pro. The game speeds on the slow game style is on simulation. Trading is disabled, which I don't know why, but I'll enable that for this video. So the injuries were all for long shot. Pre-existing injuries on player progression frequency at the end of the season. Let's not do that because that's not interesting. But aside from that, that's the only settings that you can actually edit. But if we jump into this as Bill Cower, hopefully Devin Wade didn't actually retire. Okay, so he's still on the team. Thank God. So some crazy stuff has happened, but we have made it to the year 2030 to see how Devin Wade's career went in the NFL. This took about an hour and a half. But it is what it is. I'm not going to ask questions and how it didn't actually freeze out like it does normally when you try to sim 10 years in advance. But here we are today. So I am still Bill Cower in the Texans. We went 8-8 eight and eight and unfortunately I didn't upgrade my players because I didn't have an auto upgrade. But it does, that's not really a big of a deal. So let's see what team Devin Wade is actually on. So if we go, Sean Watson had a great year. So if you look at the stats, Devin Wade is a member of the Baltimore Ravens 
and he's still putting up some pretty good stats. He's probably pretty old at this point. He is 34 and a 96 overall quarterback. What the heck? He's gone from superstar to only star development. But god dang, dude, if he's 96 at 34 years old, that means he's probably like freaking... He probably got up to a 99 overall. Like, that's, that's actually pretty freaking insane. I had no idea he was going to get that high. So looking at his ratings, look at those stats, dude insane he's only the fourth ranked quarterback at 95 so i'm not sure who the heck is higher than him but god dang dude that is some insane stats for devin wade now can we look at his career stats and see who he played for well, i'm guessing we're not gonna be able to see who he played for all the time but it looks like he's been a raven for a while he had some crazy years 42 touchdowns is the most touchdowns he's ever thrown for looks like 4400 yards is like the most uh, yards he's ever thrown for but that's not a bad career whatsoever for Devin Wade now if we look maybe he won the MVP that'd be cool if we can look at this Deshaun Watson came in second and there's no well Devin Wade actually came in sixth Derek Goff still in the league that's interesting but mental absolutely mental did he break any career passing yard records no he did not how about passing touchdowns he actually did so devin wade is 10th in the nfl for career passing touchdowns as a 34 year old he probably still has a couple years left in him so what i think i'm gonna do now is just see you know devin wade can win the super bowl wow, crazy crazy so devin wade's playing against his former team so let's see if we beat the ravens maybe we don't and looks like we hello we did so poor Devin oh god the Dolphins going 15 to 1 but that looks like that is going to do it as in today's video I did show you guys how to unlock Devin Wade and Bill Cower in a Madden 19 franchise once again super freaking simple all you gotta do is finish long shot watch the credits continue your career as Devin Wade and if you want to be Bill Cower Bill Cower is going to be your head coach but if you want to actually be Bill Cower all you have to do is create a new character choose the Texans as your team and then your coach is automatically built out. So hopefully you guys did enjoy that and found that pretty interesting. And if you did, make sure to drop a like. Be sure to subscribe if you are new. Turn on the notification bell if you haven't. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. God bless and peace.